Hello and welcome back to another episode with MH Geek and Middle Chan. So we finally both of us have uh, hit high rank and we are about to attempt our first ever high rank quest. Let's yes. go! So basically I have this crazy idea where um, for high rank I'm gonna try using a great sword instead. Mm -hmm. What do you think? When? Oh, right. Yep, so, oh yeah. In uh, High Rank Quest, we no longer start at the base camp. The old man said it. And uh, we are going to be separated. Yeah, separated. Okay. I was ready for this. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, going back to the idea of the Great Sword. Um, it's one of those weapons that I've actually never used as well. Like, I actually play bow and dual blades the most, although not in portable third. I, I don't play dual blades in portable third. Like after the re the revamp of dual blades in for you, I use it a lot. Mm. But in portable third I mainly use the sword and shield and the bow and the long sword. So I was thinking of trying to pick up s oh my gosh they are both together. Right. Yeah and they've seen you. Oh dear. And is it just me or are they huge? Nope. They look normal, I guess. But I think both them. Both. Okay. I think one of them is quite large. Significantly larger than the other, at least. Oh, yeah, yes. Okay, anyways, um. What what we're gonna do is. Ouch! I couldn't see that guy coming through. We're gonna have to try and take them down one by one and not both at the same time. I mean, it doesn't really matter, but I think it's more efficient that way. Oh, crap, my. Not not doing well. Oh my gosh! Do try no. I don't know. Uh, there's a bit of right. lag no, going on. Yeah. You might want to take down the. S uh, it doesn't matter who. Wow. Teleporting bears. That those are scary. <laughs> Jeez. What what what's with the game today? Or my internet or whatever. I don't know. Oh, you take one. I take one. That works as well. Right. Whoa! Did not see that one. Yeah. You you can warn me. You know that. Oh, he disappeared. What? Okay, um, yeah, so basically, Great Sword is a weapon that I haven't been using at, in most of the. It basically, I haven't been using Great Sword at all, to be honest. Like, I find it very slow and sluggish, but I understand that there are things like. Ouch. There are one hit wonders in which you hit and run and things like that. Different from the playstyle of using a sword and shield, long sword, or even bow, where you can. You know, always find openings and uh, try and do constant, consistent damage throughout the entire fight. Oh, that guy ran away. And the Juggy took the hit. Uh, whoa, no, no, whoa, 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 whoa. I thought he ran, but he actually... Whoa, 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 whoa. It was just a... Yeah, yeah, wow, wow, wow. Jeez. Yeah, so, I understand the differences. And uh, having played Monster Hunter for so long, I feel like maybe it's time I picked up something that I usually don't pick up. Not sure how it's gonna turn out though, but like, oh my gosh. Why do they keep... Interesting. Yeah, it might be interesting, but so, yeah. Let's, I don't know, consult the dear viewers and see what they think. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh, but then again, this episode is gonna go out until like quite a bit later, so. Oh yeah, we broke his uh, armband. Whoa! Jeez! Really? Shoot past me. Wow. I didn't shoot past you, I shot at the bear. Okay. I don't know. Yeah, so. But one thing I like about the. The bow and arrow is how precise I can be at where I want to aim. Uh, although I miss at quite a bit of times. Quite a bit of. I mean, quite oftenly. Not quite a Oh my gosh, my. Ouch! Get away from me, Juggy. Uh. So yeah, I'm not sure how how good I am at the Great Sword and okay, that, that was a bad dodge, I really dodged into it. He's coming for you, watch out. So yeah, but mm, I want the... I'll say, oh. go for it. <laughs> okay. Uh, if that's the case, then I'll start to, you know, be farming Great Sword stuff and uh... 
Yeah, ow, damn it, bear, stop it. I honestly wonder how you go. Probably I'll have like some training session videos of me soloing some monsters in low rank first, and then, um, yeah, before I take out the high rank monsters. Then again, I need to farm materials to to craft some swords right off. Uh, yeah, so, so yeah, just, just, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, the other bear ran away, so we are just going to try and take this one down. So once again, reminder that we are in hit high rank, so monsters hit harder and faster, and they are way more tanky. And rather, as in, they are not more tanky, they just have a... We just deal less damage to them, yeah. And no more items from the supply box, sad thing. Yes. That is the worst. <laughs> Alright, so being oh my gosh that Wow shoot. Wait, uh, who? Nothing. That Jagia nearly hit nearly hit me. Well I wanted to say that basically um I've brought the combo books as well in case I run out of coatings which I did run out of. Uh yeah, so I'm gonna start by you know crafting some close range coatings. Ninety five percent success chance hopefully at Come on. Ah, I got garbage, damn it. Right, what about the power coatings as well? I should craft this on the fly, but uh never mind. Let's let's go. <laughs> okay. So the reason why I brought the crafting books is of course to uh you know increase Crap. the Yeah, increase the chances of success. And so I get less garbage. So I can continuously dish out more DPS with all my coatings. But yeah, the main one of the main reasons why I want to stop using bow is because um not I wanna stop using bow correction. I would like to just, you know, switch out to the great sword resource because uh farming materials to to make the coatings is really quite tedious. So yeah. But why great sword of everything? I mean, because, see, you're already using the sword and shield. I don't want to have double sword and shield. I mean, that's viable too, but just some variation. And, uh, yeah, I haven't been using the great sword at all. Mm -hmm. And yeah, let me just toss the garbage away at the meantime as well. Garbage, garbage, garbage. Oh, oh my gosh, ow. Right. Hi, buddy. I have yet to break your arm then. So. He's angry. There we go. That's for roaring in my face. Ouch. Okay, okay, I get the point. <laughs> uh, we want to lure him out of there, so... Come here, kitty kitty. So yeah, great sword. I don't mind playing the long sword as well, but the long sword is the tri otherwise known as the triple of the worlds. So... Basically, long swords have a very long reach, as the name says, and I tend to hit as it not I tend to hit, but the sword, the weapon tends to um, hit your teammates, causing them oh. to trip. So yeah, but nonetheless, uh, nevertheless, the great, the long sword is a strong weapon. It's a good weapon. In the right hands, it can be quite devastating. You just have to be careful, be careful with where you swing that that thing. So yeah, whoa. And the great sword, on the other hand, is uh, also equally big, as in not big but long. It has a very long reach as well. But uh, oh, it's just interesting, I guess. Something that I've never really used. Ooh. I've also never used the heavy bow gun before. Whoa, close one. Heavy bow guns are cool. Yeah, but oh my gosh, you move so slow with them. Uh, yeah. And I mean. Great sword as well, but unlike the great sword, you you are uh, yeah. As in the great sword, you are up in the monster's face, hitting it with the blade master armor. But with the heavy bow gun, you know you're sitting there shooting stuff. Yeah, not not my style. I like I like moving around more. <laughs> and darn this this quest. Proceeded quite fast and quite easily, I guess. Ezra's pet plus. Nice. Oh, there's some shiny stuff on the floor. Wanna pick that up? 
Ah, I can't pick it up. It's. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Please. Oh, it's gone. Oh, it's still there. Oh, damn it. Damn it all. Whatever. Never mind. Anything else we can scavenge in this area? Oh, there are bugs to catch, right? Yeah, there are bugs. Ding. Great shroom. Oh, nice. So, uh, I'm not sure. I guess I should. Uh, I, I, right. Let me let me see how I fare against some low rank monsters using a great sword first, and uh, I'll probably craft some simple beginner blade master stuff to go with that. You can craft an Azura stuff. <laughs> Uh, I'll, I'll just use the low rank materials instead. I mean, I don't want to invest too much in this. I don't know, it depends really. Ooh, so many stout bones. Ooh, char a charm. Where should you get charms? I hope I get something interesting. Ooh, what's this? Artillery and Dark Master. Uh, okay, I don't use Garden Land, so. Right, whoa, see, I told you that one was big. It's a silver crown. And the other one is pretty small. <laughs> <laughs> right. Alright, so that was surprisingly quite a fast hunt. I did not expect that. I was thinking like maybe a high rank hunt would, would you know, take longer and stuff, but apparently not. Not when uh, we have the amazing Middle Chan with us, huh? <laughs> so, uh, the Middle are... Chan that learns how to escape whenever needed. <laughs> Push! An escape artist. Yeah, you have the natural escape artist. <laughs> Alright, so thank you all so much for watching. Um, We'll see you all in the next episode with me probably trying to fail miserably hunting with a great sword. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, this has been MH Geek. And. Hello, Chan. So, yep. <laughs> Alright, before we sign off, do remember to like, subscribe, comment if you have anything you'd like to let us know. And, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy. So, signing out. Bye.